Growing up with cerebral palsy is not easy for anyone. Anthony Humes joins us now with the story of Michael Kipe, a man who's overcoming the odds and showing cerebral palsy who the real MVP is. Anthony? Thanks, Monica. I caught up with Michael today to hear his amazing journey. Michael Kipe was diagnosed with cerebral palsy at the age of three. Since then, his life has been a journey. Michael had said uh, this last year in a scholarship essay he wrote that at this point in his life that the joys and the opportunities that he has have greatly outweighed the heartaches that he's had from CP. Michael graduated Mandan High in 2013 and attended the University of Wisconsin Whitewater where he got his chance to first play wheelchair basketball. And they have been great and that's a fantastic um, atmosphere to be in and they have allowed me to, you know, with, with no experience, come in and, and learn the game. Michael is now back in Mandan, giving teens and young kids the chance to play a sport that he never had the chance to play. Uh, growing up, um, you know, I never had anything like this. Uh, that's why I'm so excited that we're here. These kids to realize that, you know, there are opportunities that, um, you know, I can play sports, whether I want to do it at a college level or not, you know, they exist. I can, can be part of a team and, and compete. The camp is also a workout that some kids and teens may never have had. To hear kids say, I'm sore, I'm sweating, I'm hot, you know, in all reality, through maybe their therapy services growing up as young children, they may have pushed themselves to, to levels in exercise, but not to the point where you're dripping sweat. And all right, let's set it up again. This workout is helping kids work towards a better life. Michael has now won two National College Wheelchair Basketball champions, Championships at the University of Wisconsin-Whitewater, and he's hoping to do a three-peat this year. Alan? All right, thanks, Anthony.